Hello and welcome everyone. This is me, Ali Reza. I'm a Google Ads, Facebook Ads, a Bing Ads certified advertising professional as well as an owner of a Google Party company. And today I'm here with a new case study regarding Google Merchant Center, which was being suspended. Uh, you know, it's a twice suspension. Firstly, it was suspended for misrepresentation. We got it restored and then it was suspended for website need improvement. So it was a tough procedure and I already created a video regarding it and then because it went into the second suspension for website needs online improvement so you know i'm here with the, you know how we fix it what were the core reasons what were the core issues okay you know there is one thing which i be you know uh, like to tell people that there is some issue you know whenever your website needs improvement error is over there it means that you need to improve your website there could be a certain error which needs Im improvement now People often ask me what is the difference between misrepresentation error and the difference between uh, website needs online improvement. Now there is a huge difference with the web misrepresentation. Google feels that your website and your GMT and your ads data do not correlate with each other, and you know there is a confusion over there, and people can get confused. Or there are some statements on your website which do not actually represents the real scenario of the products you are promoting or you know sometimes you make a claim while in the website online needs improvement error there are certain website issues which could cause the suspension i plagiarism is one bug uh, one big uh, issue broker links is another issue google search console errors are another issue your products sample procedure of checkout also that is also an important issue usually issues like you know mentioning the payment methods on the main page and the, during the checkout if there is a difference usually it's being covered in misrepresentation but whenever if there is an even there for website needs online improvement we completely check all the errors so that we could not go into the second suspension like unfortunately in this case we had to go through but luckily you know we are here and you know the hide us and you know we sorted this issue as well now what i'm going to show you this is their website and currently they have uh, more than 3000 items and you know 3000 items is a huge number we had to go through their facebook page we had to go through their instagram page we had to look around on the website quality reviews everything website speed uh, even the newsletter working the website is in the dutch so you can see over here so we had to go on a lot of issues before we figure out if it's uh, this issue and then you know a certain channel was developed you know with google regarding restoration of this website okay and uh, now i'm going to show you some of the audits we did for this and um, so i'm going to show you some audits which were being, being done to sort out these errors and uh, i will also show you the website needs improvement error as well so this was an error website or online store needs improvement this was the error we got for this gnc and uh, the audits you know when we started doing audit you know we looked around on every aspect like plagiarism google map listing checkout procedure website review the content of the website uh, google search console errors which i told you before then we discussed that there is a plagiarism issue then you know we suggested some changes in the social media we also discussed that the bio of social media pages should have the main domain link the about us page needed improvement uh, we checked the website speed we suggested you know uh, the footer page is perfectly fine but you know contrary to this because we do multiple audits and you know the staff is being optimized for this so we also find some of the category issues on like there was a blank category on the website we also said that the font should be same do, do not have multiple fonts going on the same website because website needs improvement error is over there uh the information was in caps capital letters that is also discouraged because that makes hard to read for an ordinary user and then you know 
we may felt that there were some pages you know which were not clickable but there was being mentioned in uh, clickable links but they were not actually clickable you know the word so we highly encourage regarding the google listing uh, disclaimer page uh, was still not found plagiarism issue was over there the same errors were over there and then you know during our conversation with the google team regarding the payment methods you know uh, we uh, suggested some grammatical issues error which you know were causing suspension as well because we have multiple channels with google to sort out so one of the support uh, the team said this was and we you know removed that as well but you know the story doesn't end here we still had to do a lot of changes so you know a lot being work was done daily every day it was keep on checking the changes implemented or not and everything being found and everything and then you know that we suggested adding reviews on facebook adding reviews on website you know these were also you know the things you know which we did and then here i'm just showing you how we work with the support on email on chat on phone as a google partner we have a dedicated support we use every man mean and then uh, we utilize the staff on this as well and then suddenly you know we got this email uh, from google and this was review of website needs improvement for noha suit is complete and near margin center the requested review of website needs improvement has been completed and the issue no longer appears in your merchant center account so this was a glad moment for me and my team and you know this is a moment of appreciation and even i can show you over here as well so you guys can check live over here you can see over here you can see you can see over here that this was a last review which was rejected you can see over here and then this was a review which was finally accepted dear merchant center to re the requested review of your website needs improvement has been completed and the issue no longer appears on your account and then i'm going to show you the account and you can see over here that is fine now and you know there are more than 3000 products on the store and everything is fine and you know some days they also pursued it with uh, google shopping ads as well and you can see that everything is running fine i can even show you by doing the refresh so you know you guys have an idea that everything is uh, original and real over here so you can see that this is uh, accepted over here and you know this is all good and fine so yeah this is another successful case study regarding google merchant center restored for website or online store needs improvement i'm glad that we had another successful client in case if you need such services regarding google merchant center suspension for false statement deceiving website online store uh, need improvement mystery presentation i mean there are so many errors me and my team can help you we also help with google ad suspensions we also help uh, our clients uh, with uh, google ads disapprovals bing ad suspension uh, and definitely ppc management on google ads facebook ads or bing ads you can hire us to the link in the description and we're going to make sure to get an awesome digital marketing campaign for you so guys i look forward working with you thank you for watching take care and make sure to subscribe to the channel as well take care bye bye